One of the things that, that Amos is really concerned about uh, in terms of these people is that they'll, they'll be religious and they'll do all the religious things, but, but not with the, the right intent. And so chapter five, verse 21, I hate, I despise your feast days. I will not smell in your solemn assemblies, you know, the things they were burning, their sacrifices. Though ye offer me burnt offerings and your meat offerings, I will not accept them. Neither will I regard the peace offerings of your fat beast. So he's not saying stop being religious, right? Stop yeah. doing your offerings and so forth. But he says, if, if you're doing that without the right heart, if you're doing that without justice and mercy and righteousness, he says, I don't want any of that. Yeah. What I want is for this to transform you, to turn, in, turn you into a different person. They're missing the boat. And that's what the, these prophets are saying is that giving, giving a, 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 a generous fast offering or, or, or paying your tithing or do, going to the temple. And if, you're, if that's just you're doing it to just to check the box, you're missing the whole purpose of the, of the, um, the commandment. You know, you, you should feel it. You should be engaged in it. And it's transformative on how it affects you and changes you as a person. And if you're just say to you know somebody, hey, I pay my tithing, I give a fast offering, I, I'm I'm good. You you missed it all. It's 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 good for nothing.